Hi girlfriend and welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new. I'm so excited to bring today's video. It is in collaboration with three amazing mamas. I've teamed up with Yesenia from Yesenia's A Mom's Life, Courtney from Mama Makes It Happen, and Wayne from Mama Full Time. If you have not heard of any of these ladies, girlfriend, I am so excited to share these women with you and to tell you about them. And I will be sure to leave all of their links in my description box below. And we've all teamed up to do a fall DIY and a lot of us are bougie on a budget. Our DIYs are inexpensive and I cannot wait to share my DIY with you. My project is super simple and y'all, most of the items you already have either upstairs in that closet that's in the back that you like mm, should i hold on to it should i let it go i'm going to bring to you today a sweater diy and if you're coming from any one of my girlfriend's channels hey girlfriend my name is sherelle i'm a proud wife and mama to two hershey kisses i have an eight and a nine year old and we all share similar content so if you like lifestyle mommy cleaning and diy videos i would be honored if you would consider subscribing if you like what you see anyway girlfriend i could ramble forever so let's go ahead and get into this diy for supplies you will need jute stuffing from a pillow rubber bands scissor glue gun and your choice for embellishment Time takes a toll on it. to start i'm cutting the arm of the sweater and i'm starting at the armpit and i'm just going to cut it straight off then i'm going to cut it in half and this will give me the option of having two pumpkins that i can make what to say oh time just give us time Time Looking back on pictures And I find it hard to see You And myself in places Where we used to be Oh, time We got older, babe And I wanna stay with you Don't get time for getting you will take your jute or your twine and you will make seven loops that will give you eight strings and you will extend it to about five inches from the sleeve and you will cinch it with a rubber band. If you do not have jute or twine, I think it'd be really cute if you use four long strings of raffia. Next, you will stuff it with pillow stuffing, stuffing it however you like, and then form it around. But I wanna stay with you and don't got time for games. Now what you wanna do? Tell me now if you will go with me all the way. Every night, every day, promise will never change. Then I'm going to bring my twine and pull it through my rubber band and to make the soft sections on my pumpkin, I'm just going to pull that twine tight. Once you pull all your twine, then form it around and tie it into a knot twice and then cut off the excess. I got your letter, guess this is better. You win sometimes, lose sometimes, no need to apologize. It was the distance, 
we have between us It broke us down in disguise No need to apologize Okay, girlfriend, you can skip this next step by just placing a stick as your stem, or you can trim the top and wrap it around using some more twine. And as you wrap it around, just add small amounts of hot glue until you get to the top. I can help that I miss you now. That I miss you now Can't say I like it But I can fight it Some things are not meant to be Even if it's hard to see I'll try to let go It's not easy, you know some things are not meant to be Let's skip the apologies ooh, 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 ooh. But I can help that I miss you now And I need to reminisce Then I'm going to pull some leaves from my garland And arrange it how I like before sticking it to my base But y'all, get creative And this would be super cute If you added some burlap leaves as well But y'all, it's yours Get creative The possibilities of how you can embellish this Is endless Can't help that I miss you now After adding my leaves to my base, I thought it was missing something, so I decided to add a bow using some of my red twine. Once I cut the ends off my bow, here's the final look of my pumpkin. Y'all, it is so easy, it's quick, and it is so addicting that you'll be wanting to make a lot of them. I hope you enjoyed this fall DIY, and if you decide to make this sweater pumpkin, please tag me over on Instagram. I would love to see how yours came out. And if you like this video, please give this a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, girlfriend. And don't forget to check out my other girlfriends, because I know that they have three also amazing projects that you will love and want to do over the weekend with a group of girlfriends. All right, girlfriends, till next time, stay beautiful.